Hey guys, what's up? Hola, it is your amigo Keith here live in the control room at Essex Recording Studios just outside London in England. I've got one of the rarest, coolest ESP strats to share with you that I have ever seen in my life. The condition is phenomenal, absolutely unreal. If you're new to the channel, click like, click subscribe, come join our circle of friends. Over 5,200 of us. I share awesome guitars I find from all around the world, and I give you some up-to-date stuff going on in the music business here in England. For instance, I'll be seeing Megadeth at the end of the week. I bought all of Dave's guitars and reverb, so uh, we're going to do a little something special before the show at Wembley Arena. I'm seeing Zach Wild next month as well. I bought one of his guitars. But now I'm going to tell you about this guitar. This is an ESP 400 series Strat with the Lawsuit Fender style headstock. Now, this is something really special that I've never seen before. Has the ESP stamped vintage style saddles. Um, what I haven't seen before, it wasn't that, is a, a few things. This color, the seafoam green, the 400 series was called the 400 series because it cost $400, if I remember correctly. There's a 400 series and an 800 series. So it cost $400. I believe that was the price point. In Japan, the model numbers are based off the price. It's a very common practice in Japan. So if you look at model designations for ESP and Edwards guitars, a lot of times you'll see things like 98, 128, well, that's 128,000 yen. So generally, the not generally, the, the higher the number, the more expensive the spec. Now, I've had 800 series and I've had 400 series, and to be honest with you, when it comes to the strats, I don't really get it as far as the difference goes. Um, uh, nothing comes to mind visually sonically anything why uh why they have the two different numbers but what i will tell you it could be something as simple as having gold hardware um now that i think about it um what i can tell you is that these early 400 series are highly desirable because they are closest to kind of like a, a early early vintage fender reissue they've got rosewood fretboard they've got the six screw vintage style tremolo with the stamped saddles and then if you look at the neck 60s style one piece early 60s style one piece maple neck with vintage style tuners this is something that i mean i have to recommend highly to any fender strat collector player enthusiast but what's really insane about this got some hairs on here what's really really insane is the neck plate because this is the first one i've ever seen with the new york custom shop uh 48th street neck plate really interesting and also it looks like the serial numbers don't change regardless of whether or not it's a Japan neck plate or the New York neck plate. Also, best condition New York neck plate I've ever seen. Just goes to show you like how good the overall condition of this guitar is. It is really, really clean. I mean, there's a little bit of uh, lacquer indentation there. I don't even know if you're going to be able to see it. I'm going to try and focus. A little bit there and a little bit there. And other than that, you can kind of see it. Um, neck pockets. That side's perfect. That side, no hairline or anything. Looks like the most tiniest little thing at where the paint meets the body there. Um, this is absolutely as clean as it gets, guys. As far as value goes, this is a 
uh, British pounds. This is a 2,000 pound guitar all day. It's got the Fender so style uh, smaller threat frets. As far as fretware goes, I mean, this looks great. Super clean. Not something you see every day, that is for sure. If you want to buy this guitar, it is for sale on our website, EssexRecordingStudios.com and on Reverb.com. You can just type in ESP 400, Seafoam Green, ESP Strat. You should see this show up pretty much immediately. I ship to any country in the world. If you want to chat more about it too, just hit me up on Facebook or on Instagram. It's at Essex Recording Studios. You can leave some comments in the YouTube section, no problem. Uh, the phone on our website, you can WhatsApp that any time of the day. No worries, dudes. All right, I've got a lot of videos I have to do for you, so let me run. But leave some comments. Tell me what you think of this. If you're an ESP fan, when's the last time you saw something like this? Lawsuit, headstock, and this color... This condition with the New York neck plate. And again, in this condition. This is crazy. All right, guys. I will see you in another video coming up just after this.